In this tutorial, we will teach you how to create and email contact groups in Outlook. In Outlook 2010, the distribution list is renamed to Contact Group. This is the list that you will use to send out emails to your contacts. It is easy to create contact groups once you have created your contacts. Start by clicking the Contacts icon in the navigation pane. Then click on the New Contact Group icon. A new window will open. The first thing you need to do is give it a name, which is Office Staff in this example. Once you have named the group, it will be visible in the contacts. To make it appear right at the top, change the name by double-clicking the group and in the name bar add an underscore sign before the name. Once you have made the group, now you will have to fill it with contacts. To add contacts to the group, click on the group and click on the Add Members icon. It will show you options from where you can add members to the group. In this example, we will add members from the Outlook contacts. Once you select it, a window will appear showing you all the members, and you can add them by double-clicking on the contact. After selecting the members, click OK. A list of the selected members comes on the screen. Click Save and Close. You can, at any point in time, add a new member to the group, or a member can be deleted by selecting it and clicking the Remove Member icon. When you are done making the changes, click Save and Close. There are four ways in which you can send an email to a group in Outlook. The first one is by right-clicking on the group, going to Create, and selecting Email. You will notice that the To line is already filled with the group name. The second way to send an email is by opening the group, going to the Communicate panel, and clicking on the Email icon. The third way to send an email is by going to the Folder list. The advantage of Folder list is that you can see your contacts and mailbox at the same time, and drag the group in the Inbox folder. The fourth way to send the email is simple. You just have to click the new email icon. A new email window will open. In the toolbar, type the first few letters of the contact. In this example, type in underscore sign, and the group name will appear. Fill in the subject line and the body of the message. In Outlook, you can eliminate a group member to whom you do not want to send the mail to. To do this, press the plus sign that appears on top of the group name, and then click OK. You will see that all the group members' names will be shown, and you can now erase the one to whom you do not wish to send it to.